If you've watched my videos, then you know Florida is a pretty cool place full of amazing opportunities. Last year, I took you to a really unique place where we dug up prehistoric fossil teeth, sharks. This year, I'm gonna take you on a completely different adventure. This time, we're gonna go in the ocean. I'm gonna show you something really cool. This has nothing to do with photography. It's just about having a good time and enjoying yourself, so come on. The adventure starts simple enough on the highway, the flatlands of Florida, but all of that changes when we make it to the marina. Looks like a good day for a swim. As I climb into our boat, the first thing I notice is this bucket of dead fish. Huh, what's this doing here? And it appears that no one in our group seems to have an answer. Hmm. As we leave the dock, the waters are nice and smooth, and there's a handful of clouds in the sky. As we approach the inlet, the mighty Atlantic Ocean greets us with some nice waves as our captain increases speed. Ah yes, the open ocean, a magical place that appears never-ending and limitless, an environment I'll never grow tired of. The shoreline, it's a distant memory at this point as we head a few miles offshore. We've arrived, and everyone gets ready for the water. The water does look nice and inviting. That is why we came here, you know, to go for a swim. So I take one last look at the world around me, and then I make the plunge. The water temperature is perfect, and the beautiful blue seems to go on forever. It's calm, it's peaceful, and it's surreal. But we came here to see these. Sharks. And the first one on the scene is a bull shark. And it isn't long until this shark is joined by another. Within 10 minutes, there are five or six bull sharks just casually cruising around us. It's interesting how each shark seems to bring with it its own little school of fish. And it isn't long until our guide decides to give some of these bull sharks something to eat. And of course, the bull sharks being the creatures that they are, happily take the offering of fish by just inhaling the pieces that are floating in the water. The more time we spend in the water with the sharks, the more comfortable they get with us. They start to creep in a little closer with each passing second. And look at that one. It's got a huge hook in its mouth. Oh man, that's too bad. Floating in water that is about 150 feet deep and a few miles from the nearest landmass might seem frightening, but drifting in the ocean currents is actually very peaceful. Breathing through a snorkel forces you to take your breaths nice and slow. The deep blue color is soothing, and everyone in the group was nice and calm, which is really odd considering the company. Bull sharks have a nasty reputation of being fierce and aggressive, but these sharks, all of which are about two meters long, don't seem to have a care in the world. And then you have this curious little fish, a remora. Hey, what's up, little buddy? Remora are funny looking little fish that will usually attach themselves to another fish, like these bull sharks, and then hitch a ride. This attachment is thought to be mutually beneficial. How cool. Our guide tells us to relax because he's just spotted a 12 foot or four meter long great hammerhead circling in the distant shadows. And for a brief second, I can see its massive silhouette in the distance, but the great hammerhead decides to remain a ghostly apparition. Our guide comes to the surface and announces another arrival. This time, it's a lemon shark. He tells us this species of shark is very friendly and not to get freaked out because it will most likely come really close. And he was right. The lemon shark does get very close, which also brings the bull sharks in a little closer too. And at that point, it's a good time to head back to the boat. That was simply an amazing experience. And I'll have to admit when I first went out and got in the water, I was nervous. But as soon as I got in the water, I don't know why, but everything was just so calm. I never once was really scared of anything. It was a super cool experience. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Don't forget to click that thumbs up. And if this is something that you'd like to do, I highly recommend going with the people that we went with. I'll leave a link to their business in the description below. They're out of Jupiter, Florida. Excellent service, they kept us safe. Just was an awesome experience. And until next time, I'll see you later.